Hey guys, this is Miles Doggy here with my first Let's Play. It's gonna be Let's Play my favorite game, Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. I'm gonna have it as Dog with the Weirdo. I'm going to skip the talking that is not important and let you hear, I'm going to read the talking that is important, like stuff that tells you what to do, and just that is relevant, not irrelevant stuff like this. So basically the storyline is, Peach sends Mario and Luigi a letter with a treasure map in it, and she wants to go find the treasure with them. So we're gonna go off to this little place called Rogueport and find this legendary treasure called the Thousand Year Door. And there is the map. Prologue, a rogue's welcome. So there's the town of Rogueport. What's really cool here is the boat just flips around like it's made out of paper and Mario can just get off. He has a safe block. If you hit it, it's jumping, you can save your game up to this point. I would like to save all my progress. If you want to talk to these people, you can. Oh, get off it. Yeah, I've been walking around to ask information about the crystal stars. Well, now I'm doing the asking to be a good girl and tell us. Yeah, I know. Yeah, well, I'm going to go anywhere with you freaks. Yeah, you're not going to screw up my plans, buddy. Get a taste of the old Kropa bomb. So this is your first fight, and there's called the hammer where you, if you get, like, leave the control stick to the right, and then I screwed up there because I was talking too long. Leave the control stick to the right, and then let it go right when it lights up. You can do your damage. I'm being stylish there. I guarded there by pressing A right when something hits me. Like, that's hard to guard. And then there's jumping if you press A right before landing on them. Stylish there is a little hard, but you'll eventually get it. Stylish commands give you SP or star points. Later on, that will become important. Buh, buh, yeah. You get a couple decent shots in. It's go time. There's a ton of those little guys. Punish him! Quick, this way! I just sneak past these guys. And they don't even notice us. 
Stop! Where'd they go? Uh, Do Johnson, did you see them? Uh, crud, they bolted. Yes, yes, yes. There's Toadsworth. And they just wait till the guys in the background go away, because those guys will become important later on in the story. Yes, you can sleep at inns to replenish your HP, which if you get zero HP, you'll get a game over. Ramella joined your party. Now she can attack with you. So she's like your little partner. And if you press X around like things, if you have no clue what to do, or around people, she'll tell you about them. So she's really useful if you don't know what to do. Sometimes she'll tell you nothing at all. In battle, she can use her nasty head bonk, which has the same timing as a jump right when her head hits an enemy. Just press the A button. Let's go find her professor, Mr. Frankly. I recommend doing is going to buy some items first. Because this one guy nabs 50 of your, your, your coins. Mushrooms with plenty your HP. So buy like about three mushrooms. Maybe like one honey syrup and a fire flower just for emergencies. So then go out of your shop. And on next time on Pick Mario, we'll continue and go find Professor Frankly.